today's FA Vars first round qualifying tie between March Town and Huntington Town on a beautiful sunny afternoon here in Fenland. I'll run you through the team starting with the Hares March. In goal is Jonah Gill, Sam Garner, with Josh Burrows, Adam Brumby, Danny Emmington returning after injury, Ephraim Romanos, Lewis Gibson and Sam Green who were substitutes in last weekend's victory at Wellingborough Town. They come into the starting 11. Craig Gillies, Ryan Lennon who comes in for Jack Friend who is away and Lewis Cowie who scored twice in the Hare's last home game here in the 5-0 victory over Coventry United. be interesting to see how March particularly will get on without the talisman Jack Friend. That's Craig Gillies captains the team. And away we go. March kicking. In it comes. Towards Romanos. The head of the way. Gillies has it, then Romanos again! Deflected over to March. Romanos allowed to turn inside the penalty box. But thwarted by around two, three hunting defenders. Towards the near post. Headed away by Hunterton, back in by Cowie, then kicked away. Only back out to Cowie to Gibson. Controls. Now Cowie. Does well, Croy turns, cuts inside with his left foot, eyeing up the shot. Easy for Barker. At his right hand side. in the glorious Fenland sunshine. Now Emmington. Looking for the shot from distance and Tess Barker and he has to parry away. But in the end it's comfortable for him. But Emmington with a speculative attempt from... Must be the best part of 40 yards. Only to feet of green, now Romanos. Simple pass to Burrows. Into Cowie. First time cross left footed towards the back post to Ryan Lennon. Takes a touch left footed. Ryan Lennon! The great save from Barker there. As the ball looked to be heading into the top right corner, but Barker was there to parry away, and it's a March corner. Perhaps March is clearest chance of this half so far and of this game so again it will be Gibson to take the corner on this far side he makes the signal to his team into the box flicked on by Gillies and Lennon saved by Barker with his feet back out to Lennon Shielded off the ball, now Huntington have it, looking for a break, but lose the ball. Clear chance there for March, as Barker forced into two quick five saves. Inside now, throw a goal, Minchella. One more against Gilly, and scores! But the referee blows up there for an earlier challenge. But in fact, not a challenge, it's an offside play that's been raised on that far side. Minchella looked to have been in slotted past Gill with ease. Great finish, but that goal's going to be chalked off for the visitors. Lucky escape for March. Still 0 0. Yeah. 
March caught napping at the back there after the initial challenge, but after the referee consults with his linesman. It is a disallowed goal. Referee talking to Garner, surrounded by March players, and it seems as if he's I think he's given the free kick here. Edmonton into the box towards Craig Gillies. Barker calls, parries away. Out to Lewis Gibson, tries to chip. And it's just over the top of the crossbar. Barker was looming in no man's land there. But Gibson's chip just had a little bit too much power on it. It'll be Emmington to take over. Right footing. To prepare the two man walk. Over the wall it goes, and through the keeper it goes! And Emmington breaks the deadlock here! Over the wall, Barker is caught unaware that it's near post and it slips through him. And on 49 minutes here, it's Marchtown 1, Huntington Town 0. He marks his return with a bang, does Emmington. Free kick specialist. And it comes up trumps for March when it needed most. Barker will not want to watch that goal back. And the Hares take the lead here. Minchella beats Brumby. Not much support, but does come in the form of Adams. Now Minchella on the right hand side. Gill coming out to stop it near post. And Minchella goes very close in the side net in there. Nearly found a way in at the near post. But he had time and space there to run into and nearly paid off for the visitors. Harris Hercules. Going to Minchella. Onto the wide Blank here to McSkelly, left footed, trying to cut in. Right footed, it's McSkelly! And again! Here he is! Nearly for Huntington. In and out was McSkelly inside the March penalty box and smashes the side netting as a result. Gillies pressing down Barker. The goalkeeper wins that battle of woods. First a miss. Judgment and now Harris Hercules for on goal. Up against Brumby, cuts inside. Harris Hercules, goal for Huntingdon. And it's the equaliser here. Harris Hercules, teed up by Golden Williams, cuts inside Brumby and finds the back of the net. Gill had no chance one on one. And on 66 minutes, it's March Town 1, Huntingdon Town 1. Similarly to the FA Cup defeat here at the GR March, we'll not have it their own way. And they'll have to work for it if they are going to prevail. Now Hercules again trying to tee up Goldson Williams up against Brumby. And he still has it inside the March penalty box now, looking for a teammate up against Brumby. Brumby stands, Goldson Williams patient. Now finds 
Darnell. Venters into McSkelly. Cross into the box. And it's Stringer. Smart save from Gill at the near post. But Stringer was allowed to take a touch and have a go. He's marching well and truly on the back foot at the moment. McQuaid has it. Loose ball. Now Conyard. Just come on a substitute. Out to Cowie. Left hand side. Up against Chilvers. Inside to Sam Green. Now McQuaid. Now out to Sam Murphy. Cross turn. Left footed is Sam Murphy. Superb one handed save from Barker to tip it over the goal. That was heading for the top corner. Another March corner as it remains 1 1. So Emmington to take corner, drilled across to Sam Green. He can only hike the ball over the top. No Cowie. Superb touch from the Emmington. Switch ball up against Adams. Crosses towards. Rob Conyard! Yeah! Oh, yeah, over there. That's a superb finish from the substitute! Rob Conyard! Cowie did magnificently well to control that ball from Ellington. Cross towards Conyard at the near post and he chips over Barker into the far corner to make it march down two. Huntington Town one. 84 minutes played. That's exactly what the doctor ordered for March. Having had to weather the Huntington storm for the last 15 or 20 minutes. But a moment of quality there between Cowie, Emmington and Conyard proves key. As Bark had no chance of stopping that looped effort from the substitute. And March have their noses in front yet again in this FA Vars tie. Golson Williams trying to feed it into Minchella. Onside! Yeah! And I think that's gone in! It seems to have done. Guys, we're not sure. The bench are complaining, the players are running to the lines with there. It seems to have hit the stanchion inside the post. With three minutes to go, could Huntington have an equaliser here? It seems as if the substitute Charlie Vincella struck inside the corner, inside the post. Gill rooted to the spot, but as the referee consults with his linesman to see whether that did cross the line. We'll find out in a few moments. That's the ball. It looked like it hit the inside of the post or the stanchion and back out into play. And it looks as if the referee is not given the goal. Huntington are absolutely livid. Decision. And the referee instead has given a throw in. Yeah. And that is that in this FA Vars first round qualifying tie. Plenty of controversy in the second half. After Danny Emmington broke the deadlock with a free kick four minutes from the restart
Matt Harris Hercules equalised for the visitors 17 minutes later with a smart finish one on one with Jonah Gill. Substitute Rob Conyard then retook the lead for March 15 minutes later on 84 minutes before Huntington thought they had a second equaliser where a strike looked like it hit the inside of the post maybe inside the stanchion but the referee and the linesman de deemed not so and it remained 2-1 after that point but step six Huntington have much to be proud of here against a team that's made a perfect start to their league campaign and they've continued that momentum here in the FA bars as they've put their early cup hoodoo to the side and they will now play either Framlingham or Norwich United in the second qualifying round stage to take place next month. Plenty of disputable decisions but nonetheless the final score here at the GR is March Town 2, Huntingdon Town 1.